Let's talk about the Wooden Award, Women's Player of the Year Award, and let's go over the nominees for this year's award. South Carolina's Aaliyah Boston was the SEC Co-Defensive Player of the Year. She led the league in double-doubles while ranking second in blocks. Now, UConn's Paige Beckers looks to take home more hardware. She became the first freshman selected as the AP Player of the Year. Louisville's Dana Evans led the ACC in scoring this season at over 20 points per game. She became the ACC Player of the Year for a second straight season. SEC Player of the Year Ryan Howard of Kentucky was one of just six major conference players to lead her team in points, assists, and rebounds. And Melissa Smith nearly averaged a double-double this season at Baylor. She tied the NCAA tournament single-game record for most made field goals without a miss. What a year it has been in the women's college game. And we are so pleased to be joined by one of the finalists, now live on SportsCenter, UConn's Paige Beckers. Now, Paige, uh, it's so great to have you with us. I want to talk about a couple of different things. But uh, first, do you mind if I tell you something? Yeah, go ahead. Okay. I, I just wanted to tell you right now that you are the winner of the 2021 <laughs> Wooden Award. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah, absolutely. So what does it mean <laughs> to you to win this? Are you surprised? Uh, yeah, I mean, I'm surprised every time somebody picks me fit for just such a uh, big award. So, uh, yeah, I mean, it's a blessing. So what does it mean to you to win the award? I mean, it means everything to me just to be able to, I mean, win these individual awards. But it's a true testament to our whole team and uh, everything that they've done for me, the coaching staff. Um, just for them to put me in this position, I'm just extremely thankful. Okay, see, Paige, I thought I was going to surprise you. You were ready for me, though. So, I, I, But I do want to ask you about your season. What, do, what you did as a freshman, I, I just have to say, was unprecedented. Why do you think you adjusted to the collegiate game so quickly? I think just because of the, the pre preparation my coaches did for me in practice um, and in the off offseason, um, everything they did for me, they made it easier um, in games. Just because practice was so hard, they tried to beat us up in practice and make sure that practice was much harder than any game we'd ever play in. So all credit goes to them. Okay, so they beat you up in the practice to get you ready for the games. I, I know this season didn't end how you wanted it to, but the Huskies figure to be a favorites once again next season. So how are you now approaching your sophomore season? Um, really just trying to get a national championship. Um, obviously, we came up short in the Final Four this year. Um, and it, it's been hurting every se every day since. So, and it's going to hurt until we win one. So, I'm just looking forward to getting back to work. See, I like your competitiveness, and I know you've had a full season now playing under Gino Ariema. So, I, I have to ask you, how would you describe what it's like to play for him day in and day out? Hard, very hard, <laughs> challenging. Um, but nah, he's a genius. He's a re really smart guy um, just to see and get under his wing. All that he does for basketball and all that he does here. Um, you can see why the program has been so successful over the years. Now, I, I know you have a close friendship with Gonzaga star Jalen Suggs. You go back all the way to elementary school in Minnesota. So what was your reaction to his game winning buzzer beater to beat UCLA and advance to the national championship game? I was screaming at the TV. I knew as soon as it left his hand, I knew it was going in because that's just the shots that he makes. And that's just what he's been doing since uh, middle school. So I wasn't surprised at all. Obviously proud and just I was not shocked, but it was just like, wow, moment just for him to do that. I mean, it's something you dream of doing as a little kid. Yeah, absolutely. You think you could take him one on one? Oh, yeah, for sure. I, <laughs> I've told him this plenty of times before. Next time we play, I'm going to be. Okay, so so what happens tonight? Who's your pick for the national championship? I, I'm never going to bet against my guy, Jalen Suggs, so I got Gonzaga. Okay, okay, we heard it right there. Paige Becker, so good to talk to you. The winner of the John R. Wooden Women's Player of the Year Award presented by Wendy's, given by the Los Angeles Athletic Club. Paige, appreciate the time. Congratulations on a wonderful season, and congrats on winning the award. Thank you. Thank you so much for having me. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.